welcome out of the shed. This is um, part three of the um, Kelpie Custom Moto headlight and blinker install. And um, we've actually finished it today. Um, a little bit of drama. Somehow I managed to blow a fuse when I was fitting the blinkers. Um, I checked the bloody blinker fuse, it wasn't that, blah, blah, blah. It turned out to be the bloody little um, 7.5 auxiliary fuse for some reason. I must have touched the wire somewhere and shorted. But anyway, everything's working now, and um, I'm quite happy with the outcome. I've, you know, I've gotten this headlight back further. It doesn't look like a, a locomotive headlight there. I, um, I, I was on the, um, the, one of the group pages there the other day, and someone had put a vinyl piece around there, and I went, no, that's a good idea. I might put a bit of vinyl wrap on there that I had left over from, from doing this. So I've put that on there, and everything's mounted up well. Everything's working, so I'll just turn this on now, and um, then we can see the headlight working. When you would have looked at the last video I did of this, just by changing this over, I've probably got a better headlight, which, you know, here and now for me, because I don't do much night rolling, but it's, I, I think it's improved the look, but it's also saved about 1.3 kilos, because you would have seen in the last video that um, I'd done um, weighed all the parts that came off, and then I weighed all the parts coming back on, and yeah, there was, there was a good weight saving there, and um, I like the look of this, so, I'll, I'll do a pan around now because I've changed changed a few things on here. I've I've got rid of um, a few um, oh, these silvery highlights. So I'll just do a bit of a pan and then um, there'll be a bit of a slideshow as I as I show you how I you know went doing this. And um, yeah, just give us a moment. just to show you what it looks like. I'm, I'm quite happy with the way it came up. Um, oh, can't pass the light. But yeah, I think that um, sort of suits the bike. Um, another little um, exercise in the shed gives me something to do. I've got two advantages now. I've got a better headlight and um, I've saved some weight. I think saving weight is one of the best things you can do on a bike. I'd like to know how, all up how much I've actually saved over all the things that I've done. So anyway, that's it. Come in closer. You can see a bit more detail in, in there. I think it's come up quite well actually. I mean, it's not a professional job, but um, I do what I can out here in the shed. So, 
I think it looks pretty good myself. I, I, well, I like it. That's the main thing. So anyway, I'll see you next time out in the shed.